Kangaroo versus Transformer. Wow, you knocked his block off. Careful, Rue's got friends in some high and low places. Of course, it's anyone's fight in the end. Don't forget, Hippo plays the winner. Uh, looks like we'll need new parts and a whole new zoo. Of course, the aquarium can be fun too. Hmm, these pinchers could use some extensions. Grab some broken toys for a few spare parts. Now things are about to get really wired. You can never have too many pinchers. He's ready to rumble or hit the disco, whatever comes first. Now it's your turn. Think of it like one big puzzle. Well, that's one way to build somebody up. Wow, look at the muzzle on this guy. But a croc doesn't have to be too scary. In fact, why don't we add all sorts of colors? Yeah, go from crab to mantis shrimp, just like that. Now this brings new meaning to four eyes. Grab some wires for a brand new exoskeleton. Cover with foil and add a matching tail. Now let's just add a few final touches. <laughs> and you know who could use some arms. Much better. The red's nice, but a croc needs some scales. Fill up every nook and cranny, even around the arms. Besides, we'll still have plenty of red, just in your mouth. Plus some white teeth and blue lipstick. Wow, guess this guy really is blue. Daba D, Daba Die. Still, we could always use a splash of green, too. Hmm, don't like the color? Well then, just paint over it. Ah, you're almost done. Just add a few more pieces. Of course, slow and steady sometimes wins the race. Yeah, you really want to get the drool just right. And those boils looking their bloodiest. So, are you guys ready for a rematch? Careful, I'd avoid those teeth. Didn't I tell you? Well, your Transformers all in pieces. Next time, a little hot glue might help. Yeah, this ain't your average Happy Whoa. Meal. Well, at least it's still got some neat toys. Oh, it bites. Oh, are you feeling all right? Looks like he's feeling better and inspired. Guess he's got an eye for crafting. He's gonna fix up this kangaroo. Let's start with some leg extensions. We're gonna need something sharp, 
The claws are coming out tonight. Next, those paws. Sand them into shape. Of course, we need a hands-on approach. Some clay will help smooth things out. Now it's time for a quick incision. Of course, he's gonna need some teeth. Cover him up with some yellow paint. Huh, and here I thought the platypus was weird looking. Next up, why don't we fix up this giraffe? Let's just trim a little off the top. Now grab the heavy artillery. Take what's left and sand it into place. Don't worry, you'll get new legs, a whole bunch. Some clay and wires will help whip things into shape. Just don't forget to make some room for spikes. Oh, looks like dentals included in your makeover package. But even a scary giraffe could use a fresh coat of paint. We can't forget your spots either. Uh-oh, looks like something's breaking at the zoo. And not just the fights. Hey, a hippo. Let's clean him up. But first, it's lunchtime. Save those bones, we can use them. I'm starting to get star nose mole vibes. But we can use some clay around the jaws. Now let's saw off those legs. We can always get new ones. We'll need some clay, spikes, and a pair of red eyes. Just remember one thing about spikes. They can be a real pain in the back or side. Mm, our zoo's almost done, but there's still room for a gorilla. At least what's left of him. We can rebuild him. Let's fill in those limb extensions. Beads and spikes add a needed touch. As do spider legs. My, what big paws you have. And look at those teeth. Of course, pink really isn't his color. Silver back gray and blood red for those boils. Looks like our zoo's ready. Well, just not for business.